Hello. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Hi, how are you? Fine. It's great tonight. <laughs> yeah, why is that? Why are you so happy? Uh, because uh, we took a, a four day off uh, to a, a long rest. Uh, it's a, this a beginning the, 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 this week. It's a more energy after the, the four day off. You think so? Off. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> All right, good. That's true. That's true. One thing, there was a lot of traffic today. Yes. In the morning, I, I think it was, was a, uh, there was a problem in, for the, what do you say, for, for protesta? I don't know. <laughs> Manifestations. Oh, so there were manifestations. Ah, uh, yes. Oh man, really? So, what are the manifestations about now? I uh, we said me yeah, is about the 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 veterans of, of the veteran of war is uh, it took uh, many many uh, streets and uh, block block the, the the traffic. Oh. But, but what what are they protesting about now? I don't know. I I I I, I couldn't. Uh, what's the, the 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 news? Only for the other person, say me <laughs> only. Today I I I, I couldn't watch the news. <laughs> Did they burn Bukele? I think he is a uh, for, uh, yes again the B Bukele. I think this is a is a politics uh, matters. Yes, it's always going to be a. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh man. All right, sir. Uh, how are you? How's your COVID? I'm Mister. Me, uh, I, I really, I feel much better now, but. I don't deserve COVID to anybody. It's not, it's not good. <laughs> it's I don't, no, you say, you say, I don't wish. Okay, I don't wish any COVID to anybody. See, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, I was in bed. Now okay. I, already, I already go out to work and everything, but, but it's, it's very sad. It's, Wait, but you, you, I thought it's two weeks. You're not supposed to go out. Yeah, yeah, but I couldn't. I, yeah, it's supposed to be. I I I, I go out just a, a bit because I need to do something. But but I'm I'm not I'm not I'm not that two weeks. But I have to. But you know you know you know what? Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. I feel I feel kind of tired when when, when I go out today. You had I had to take so many pills that 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 my, that my body really deserve to rest. Yes, it's true. So now that I go out, I, I, I feel kind of dizzy. Oh, okay. Yeah, but I feel, I feel much, much better than last week. Okay. Good evening. Hey, what's up, Gio? How you doing, man? Hi. What's it going? I'm all right. How how was your vacation? Yeah, pretty well. A uh, couple of what didn't today. you do? <laughs> mm, a couple of visits to the lake and a couple of party parties. Wait, wait, when house. you when you say I'm sorry. Sorry. When you say a couple of visits, that means you went more than one time? Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Oh. Yeah, because I, I, I visit the Ilopango Lake. I have a, like, let me see, maybe 20, 25 years ago, the last time I visit, visited. And you went for business or pleasure? Ah, for pleasure. Yeah. 
And then the Ilopango is a pool, right? Yes. How is it? Is, I hear it's dangerous. Is it? No. Uh, I have that mind that in mind, but uh, because I was uh, making some uh, some Corsa to uh, ads, so I, I I take the decision. I take the decision to go there and it's quiet it's just it's not tranquilo <laughs> okay everything okay then i'm going to the to the centro no okay mm -hmm. so everything is okay then yeah yeah all right let's go back to the covid you know what's gonna happen next yeah tell me <laughs> Well, this okay. happened to me, and don't be surprised. When I was a little kid, I used to have asthma. Yeah. And um, people say that asthma never disappears because it's in you forever. But when I was a little kid, I frequently got asthma attacks. And then I never had asthma attacks again. Then I was 50, I was in my teens and my 20s. 30s and I never got asthma attacks again. When I got COVID, yeah. after the COVID, like a month and a half ago, I was really sick and I got an asthma attack. So um, the doctor asked me because I told the doctor, but look, doctor, uh, I mean, I, I used to get attacks when I was very little, but like it's been years. I don't even remember my last attack. And he says, that is strange. Have you had COVID? And I said, yes, I had COVID in, um, in January. He said, oh, okay, there you go, sequelas. It's like, oh, okay, uh, yeah. so I'm not saying that's going to happen to you, but if yeah. it's yeah. COVID always, and if not, it leaves you something. Yeah, that, that, that's what I have here. That's what I have here. That's leave you something. <laughs> yes, it, it leaves you something always. Yeah, Be Maybe because I was that's trigger everything again. <laughs> yes, it tri there you go. That's a good quite that's a good uh, way to express triggered. It yeah. triggers everything again. And yeah. I said, Oh man, now I have asthma again. Yeah. Today, today I almost had a, an asthma attack. I'm going to tell you a little story of what happened today. I was a very big chicken today. My you, my you I'm sorry? sorry you eat a, you eat a big chicken no i was a chicken today uh, i was a big okay. big chicken <laughs> mm. in other words what <laughs> happened is that my son is very sick he keeps on coughing and coughing and coughing so we took him to the doctor and the doctor says you know he should have a covid check uh. and i said what He's a little kid. He says, no, little kids, uh, four, and my son is four or five. So no, but now kids are getting COVID. Yeah. So are you serious? Oh my God. So immediately next door we went and we had the exam, but there were like three little kids doing the exam. And you know, then one little kid passed and the little kid started crying, ah, but it was this terrible pain. Ah. And I felt bad in my son. Like he said, what's wrong with the kid dad? I'm Oh, I don't know. I don't know what to tell him. And then I told my wife, let's go, man. He's okay. He's not sick. No, no, no. He has to go. He's okay. He's not sick. Look, he doesn't have a fever. And I started getting um my breath. You know, I started getting like, <laughs> I started getting like high pressure. I don't know what happened, but I didn't want to go in with my son. And um, so what happened was that I stepped out of the office because I was wearing the mask yeah. and, that, and that wasn't really helping me. So I was, <laughs> and I started running out of breath and I went outside to try to vomit. And yeah. when I came in, they were, they were putting that thing up my son and I don't know. So I, I, I couldn't imagine my son suffering. That, that was the problem, but I was getting almost an asthma attack because of that. And you know, mm -hmm. my wife was very angry. Why? You leave everything to me. But I said, look, I'm mm -hmm. sorry. <laughs> I'm mm -hmm. sorry. I, I couldn't control myself. And then and then I, and I said, <laughs> Yeah, you know, stupid COVID. 
So let's hope nothing happens to you. Mm. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah, but it's very, it's very sad. This sick is this, so it's very sad. Yes, and now there's like a new version of like five yeah, new versions. Yeah, there are four new versions. Yeah, that are more contagious. So yeah, right. exactly. So that's what I tell people. You know, I don't care if you think this is a conspiracy or if not, but this is real. Yeah. It's real, man. <laughs> so, hi, Janira. How was your party? Hi, teacher. Are you still partying? A party? No. Are you back in San Marcos now? Yes. Because last time we spoke, uh, you were in a very big party. Uh, in my house. Yeah, I remember. I had a dinner for my graduation. Yeah, and tequila and everything. <laughs> no, only soda. <laughs> oh, no. All right. What about you? Hi, Rosalena. How are you? Fine. Very, very good. Just working, working a lot. Oh, yeah. I mean, in the hotel business, these days yeah. were, were good, no? It's a, a very high season. It's a high season, yes. With a lot of movement. What nice. <laughs> nice. What about you, Jaime? How are you, sir? Jimmy. I, I, I am I'm trying to practice my English, to improve my English. I don't know. Let's go. What did you do on vacation? Nothing only. I stay at home, not really to because you have to take care because for the for the COVID, no, you need to, to yes. uh, care with the all the measures is important. Yeah. You know, you know what's sad about COVID right now? I remember like a year ago, everybody was very pending on, on the news. Yeah. Oh my god, a hundred and yeah, yeah, I'm a hundred and cien contagious every day, every day every day and everybody was worried now it's the same amount and people don't worry but they are increasing here i don't know the people had dying uh, that they, they with the covid no yeah the last 20 24 hours you know is a uh, 13 or not i can no see 13, 13 people die no yeah i i don't know the only thing I'm but, telling but, you, but the but the United States, a lot of people that increasing a lot. The look, yeah, the only thing I want to tell you is anybody who has kids, children are getting COVID too. So yeah. be careful. Yes. yes. Yes, it is. Yes, yes it is. So be careful. Yes. Um. Um. Because I was telling the class that today I went because my son is very sick. You know, but it's a normal flu. But uh, no, 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 but, even, no, no that's, but he couldn't stop coughing and coughing and coughing and fever. So we took him to the pediatrician and um, the pediatrician really surprised me when he says, look, uh, I need him to have a COVID exam. I said, what? COVID? He's a kid. No, his children are getting it. They, it's not a, the impact is not so high like in adults, but now children are getting it. He told me in Floresta, I don't know where. It was in the schools that a teacher was sick. She got all her students sick. So, well, you know, uh, luckily my son, you know, uh, we had the exam and he's okay. But what I was really shocked is that now even, my son is four and a half. Mm -hmm. So now even children are getting COVID. So yeah. please, if you have children, please be extra, extremely extra careful. Mm -hmm. Be careful, yeah. Because soon, maybe we'll start seeing that even children are dying now. And, and that's going to be a big chaos if that starts happening. So be careful, okay? If you have children, just don't go out. Stay home. <laughs> yes. Yeah, Ricardo, you are, you are working at home or you are going to the, to the office working or you are working at home office? I have to to attend them in, in, in is no no home working because my my kind of work is as a supervising the and view and analyze problems so we have to to go to my job. 
you have to stay every day with, with people, I don't know, discussing, whatever that you need to, to working with us, with them. With them. Yes. yes, I have to, to, to review the, 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 the dates of quality control many days because I work in um, um, spinning, spinning uh, mills. So the spinning is very difficult. We have to control various steps in the, 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 the process. How can I do for, for not, not getting COVID? What can no. I do? What? That? What can I do? No. What can I do? Don't do, no. don't do anything. <laughs> Stay mm. home. Yes. That's it. Don't do anything. Stay home. Yes. It's you know, you know, before the class, before the class started, I was speaking with Ricardo and he was so happy. <laughs> I said, hi, how are you? He says, I'm extremely happy teacher. I said, why? Because it's Monday and we're back to work. So, uh, <laughs> what, what, yes. So, oh man, I, I, I was thinking to myself, Ricardo doesn't like to be home. He, he likes to be in his <laughs> office. <laughs> Everybody was I, depressed today. Like, oh my god! I I, I, I work for for this this month. Uh, I work uh, at city years in the same place, <laughs> so I enjoy my jobs. <laughs> Thirty years. Thirty years. Yes. Wow. You you're the owner now. <laughs> <laughs> no. But but it's, it's because we have to 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 share with other partner is um a Japanese person so we have to talk about uh, the the quality and so a new products uh, um, many things of quality of uh, yeah, the spinning the spinning mills. Oh, I'm sorry, thirty years. Did you did you start in the war? How long ago was the war in Salvador? Uh, you sir. When did you start working there? What, what, what exactly? What year? Ninety one, yeah, right? It, 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 ninety one, yes, ninety one. Oh, okay, 91. the war had finished in ninety one, correct? Yes. Be before, before I, I work at as professor in the university for four years. In no, the, no, no. But, the, but when when you started when you started working there, yeah, uh, the war had already finished, correct? The the, the civil war. The sea war. I guess I don't know, the war. Ah. Remember Arena fighting for the rights of the people and um, FMLN fighting for for the poor. Ah, yes, yes. At the, at the end of the war, yes. Yes. When so, did so, the war finish? In 92, correct? 92, yes. in, in, in 92 in January, in the 1st the January, I think. That... So when you started working there, it was still war. Yes, it's still war. Oh, okay, interesting. But, but I, I, I live in the war because uh, when uh, I left uh, to San Miguel in the eighty-three, the 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 nineteen eighty-three, I left the San Miguel to San Salvador. Oh, okay. Yes, it, eighty-three is the the wars of the war in San Miguel. Man, I, yeah. It's a good thing that that our children will never see that. Well, maybe now they, they will because um, did you see Diablito Ruiz? He says that he's ready again for the war. Yes. <laughs> yeah. He says that they're ready more than ever. And Violeta Mejiva with Facundo Guardado. Oh yeah, they, they say that a lot of people are calling them and saying, please, we're ready. We're ready with all. They're going to come back with bigger than ever. <laughs> yeah. hmm. Yes. <laughs> you know, I wonder if they think, like, do you think actually people believe you? But uh, maybe they do. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Yes. So uh, I think the last time, oh, well, we did, remember we did this listening. Akiko yes. isn't used to eating vegetable and soups. We mm -hmm. did this part. People in France study Britain. No, this part we didn't do, I think. Instructions, combine the sentences using the words in parentheses. Remember to use capital letters and periods. People in France study British English. Japanese people generally study American English. So what would be the correct here? 
Unlike. Yeah. Unlike people in France, Japanese people generally study American, American English. English. All right, good. One thing, remember, remember what I told you last time about capital letters? Where do you put capital letters? Um, At the France. beginning of the, the, the sentence. And, Proper uh, names? In every noun. Yeah. Every noun. Every Pretty much in that. It, yes, but if it's a, for example, como es la cosa? It's in every day, month, and title. Title. Title like uh, Dr. Geo. Yes, for example, yes. look, here it says people in France, because France is a proper name, right? People, because France. it's the beginning of the, of the sentence. People in, in France study British English. That's a title, British English. British English. Japanese people generally study American English. Notice how American English is, English. it's also, um, now this is very, I, I think this is good because in Spanish, this doesn't exist. No. Nah. In Spanish, we only put the capital at the beginning of the sentence or in a proper yeah. name, right? In a proper name, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. I have that problem now because sometimes when I write hoy, lunes, tanto de febrero, I always put lunes in capital. Oh man, I forget. All right. so. Number two, let's see. Number two, Rosalena. It says some people love online shopping. Some people have never shopped online. While some people love love online shopping, period. Some people have never shopping shopped online. Shop online. Shop, shop online. Very good. Uh, number four, can you do number four, Ricardo? Okay, number four. Uh, su, super and uh, traditional, except for the fact that uh, they want her to live a career. Sus parents are traditional. Sus, sus parents are traditional, except for the fact that they want her to have a career. Is that okay? Does everyone um, have that? Yes. <laughs> All right, cool. Yeah, oh, but, no. but the, the, the question is because uh, the, the wrong in the in the platform is it because uh, uh, there are a comma. I don't know why why the comma in, in the in, uh, between in the uh, traditional comma except for the fact. I don't know why the comma. There is a, a it have to be in a space. But it doesn't. Oh, so it's another um, platform mistake, right? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. As always. Yes. <laughs> as, as usual, usual. <laughs> we I try the as different usual, way for yeah. the, for as the, to the mistake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Before we go to part two, who can give me an example of this sentence? Um, now I do it, and I remember my mother. I have a lot of food and I don't want to eat children in Africa. <laughs> Who can give me that sentence? Um, so here's the scenario. People, unlike uh, people in Africa, uh -huh. um, David had a lot of food to eat right here. <laughs> Yes, and you don't want to. <laughs> you don't want to. <laughs> it was funny. I, I was watching my wife yesterday or today. I don't remember that. She was saying, baby, you have to eat. Look, there's so many poor children dying. <laughs> Why, you sound like our parents. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, that was good. You know, unlike children in Africa, we are thankful we have food and we don't appreciate it. All right, part two, instructions. Rewrite the sentences using the words in parentheses. Remember to use capital letters and periods. Number one, Jimmy Man, J-Man. I, 
I like to know why don't more people care about, about good manner? Good manners. Manners. Okay. Does everyone have that? Yeah. Mm, yes. I like to know. All right, cool. I like I, to know if really people like really they like Bad Bunny. Mm. <laughs> no, but like there's a difference between like listening to music, you know, just for fun or like I like to know if there are people that really consider that talent. I, I, I like to know, I, I would like to ask my neighbor, but I'm, maybe she will shoot me. <laughs> All right, number two, how can people afford to buy homes in this city? Let me see, Ro, uh, who, who, let me see who can do that. Michelle, are you there? Yes. Can you um, tell me? The second one. Yes, please. Um, how people can afford to buy homes in this city, it's beyond me. How people can, okay, good. Do you understand the, 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 um, the word afford? Yes. To be able to pay for something? Yes. So afford, afford is related to money, right? Or, or a risk. Or a risk. Like, for example, a, if I hire you, it's a risk I can't afford. I can't hire you because you're, it's a risk I can't afford. So remember, it's, 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 it's always in a sentence or it's related with money. Yes. It's like, for example, me, when I see like it's maybe tipo 20, the mess, and I see people go to eat sushi. <laughs> How the hell can you afford to eat sushi? <laughs> you know, I, 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 almost at the end of the month when, when everyone is poor. Yeah, I can't afford to eat sushi now. Or like those Everybody people that, eating hmm? eggs. <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah, some people taking eggs and and How do you want your eggs. <laughs> Maruchan. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and they're Maruchans, yeah. Okay, <laughs> um, can you afford can you afford to um to eat lunch? Every day in a restaurant? I mean, there's a difference between that. You I can mean, do it, yes, but can you afford it? Because yeah. Yeah. that's I a difficult would, part. But I can't. Yeah. <laughs> I would, but I can't, I so I, I won't. <laughs> I would if I could, but I can't, so I won't. So I won't. Okay. Bup, 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 bup. All right, let me see upscale Ooh. restaurants. Let's do this. Yanira, can you do number three, please? Number three. Uh, what I don't get is why more upscale restaurants don't serve vegetarian dishes. Yes. What I don't get is why, okay, so we understand what upscale is, right? I don't get it. Upscale. Mm -hmm. Why don't? Scale is similar in Spanish, scala, right? So upscale, you know, you have Don Pollo, but if you want to impress the girl, you go to Pollo Campero, man. You know, you are upscale. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, pupusas, if you want to upscale, you go to Choris. <laughs> And you want to upscale Econo Combos in Wendy's. Upscale a full combo in Burger King. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm joking. No, but that, that is upscale, you know, like upscale restaurants. So it says, why don't, um, 
uh, what I don't get is why don't more uh, uh, upscale restaurants serve vegetarian dishes? Do you know anyone who is vegetarian? Yes. Are you a vegetarian? Mm, no, but I prefer vegetables than that meat. Okay, good. No, be, and the reason why I'm, I'm, I'm asking is because it is very expensive to be vegetarian in El Salvador. Okay. Yes. Ironic. No, but ¿cuál es la otra? Está veg vegan. Vegan is very vegan. difficult. Vegano. Yeah. That's... Vegan. And that's it's just torture because you can't even eat eggs, cheese, anything from an animal, right? Only plants. But what I'm saying is very expensive to um, to eat, to be a vegetarian in El Salvador. And it should be very, very cheap. Should be. It should be, but but imagine you go you go to a, a salad for six dollars. Mm. It's good business. Very expensive. Mm -hmm. Okay, next. Number four. Can we start over, Gio? Can you do number four? Yeah. I wonder if people will ever stop fighting with each other. Yeah, I wonder that too, but I, that will never happen. No. Never. So I wonder if people will ever stop fighting with each other. will ever stop fighting with each other. Good. I wonder if El Salvador will ever go to a World Cup again. <laughs> I wonder if... I wonder... Well, there's a lot of things that we, people say with that expression. I wonder if... I wonder if I'm ever going to have another son. Another child, which I don't think so. Mm -hmm. I wonder if I'm ever gonna get married again. Be kind of cool. Next, it says circle the words. Instructions: circle the words best complete each sentence. So Jaime, number one, Delia used to blank norms, but now she is rebellious. Rebellious. Uh, Delia used to confront no, norm, but but now she is rebellious. Okay, it's norms. Mm -hmm. Can you repeat norms? Norms. 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 Number two, Michelle. John. It says John hates to. Challenge the status quo. quo? Is that how you say that? Yeah, word? status quo. Well, status quo. Well, like status quo. What does status quo mean? I'm sorry, can you repeat? Did you ask a question? Yes, I want to know what's the meaning of the status quo. quo. Okay. And ask who can help her. Don't say it in Spanish. Give her the explanation in English. Where's Jordana, man? Gio, you're Googling, you're Googling it. Yeah. I can see Not it. Not Googling. That is cool. Let me see. It's similar in Spanish, no? Yeah. I think so. Yeah. It's like a social position. Okay. What else? Or... Um professional position or uh, label of life. Yes, or the way it should be. Mm -hmm. The status quo. Mm -hmm. Let me give you an example. Um, religion. Religion follows very much the status quo according to the Bible, you know. Yeah. Okay, Michelle, for example, um, the status quo says that um, 
the woman should always obey the man. Maybe you don't believe in that, and it's, it's I believe in everything, but people who are very religious, they follow the status quo and they have to follow that norm, that law. So then the status quo in this case would be the law, the, the religion, the Bible, the belief. Do you understand? Yes. Yes. Status quo, literalmente en estado en qué? La expresión latina status quo es en latín, significa ese, ah, por ejemplo, la novena legislación modificará el status quo de la nación. La, la, los grupos extremos amenazan los status quo de los países del Medio Oriente. Hoy la usamos otra vez, que es el status quo, es... Uh -oh. en, en, en right, en right, en right, es right, es más clear estatus quo en your rights. Yes. Estaba oh, pasando un determinado momento. Aquí está yes, la perfecta estatus. explicación, es el estado o situación de ciertas cosas. Your social position or whatever that is, is, is it your status quo? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Estado o situación de ciertas cosas, como dijo Rosa Elena. In state of affairs, especially regarding social or political issues. El status quo de Salvador ahorita es un caos, políticamente. Yes. Yeah. Bueno, siempre lo ha sido. Mm. Eh, significa And la situación política. Never. Yeah. La situación yes. política en El Salvador es un caos o el estatus de político status quo en El Salvador es un caos. Es un caos, ya. Rosa Chávez, I don't know, you know the news o Rosa Chávez, Vatican yeah. News. Yeah, he's an idiot. Yes. No, no. Yes. He should worry about the pedophiles in his institution, not He politics. He, he, he changes uh, the, the depending on the situation. Yes, he he can't he can't have an opinion. He doesn't work. He doesn't pay taxes. He doesn't have family. The status quo. Cool. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> he doesn't know what is traffic. He, he doesn't know anything. So he can't. He should worry about the pedophiles in his institution. Like Monsignor Romero. No, yeah, he's an idiot. Maybe Simon is paying him with little children or something. No, no. I, in my opinion, I don't think I don't think he should be involved. He shouldn't. He shouldn't have an opinion. Okay, number three. It says when Jennifer was young, she was, but now she is conservative. Don't come for me. Non-conformist. Yeah. Non-conformist. This is the glass generation today, right? They're very non-conformist. Yeah. For anything. Number four, it's easy for some people to blank for themselves. Stand up. Stand up. Okay, so once again, do you remember what stand up is? What is it, Gio? I uh, remember it's when, when you, you, that, this is a form to say it, but when you fight for some, for your beliefs, yes, for something you, yeah, you have your remember. ideals, your principles, yeah, ideals, yeah, yes, when you, when you, yeah, stand up is when you still believe and you will fight and you will represent your ideals. You know, like the Cristiano Ronaldo followers, you know, mm -hmm. they like to, um, <laughs> if it's okay for men to wear makeup, they, they, start, they stand up for their beliefs. It's no problem. 
<laughs> I'm joking. Number five, many teens prefer to blank than to be their own person. Fit in. Fit in. Fit in. Fit in. Fit in. Good. You know, to be honest, I think this is when a, when a child's life starts to get ruined. Fit in. Because sometimes to fit in, you have to be some, somebody you're not. Yes. And I don't think that's cool. That's why listening to rock music really saved me because if not, I would have been always with the cool kids listening to the cool music. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Listening to rock music helped me be a, a misfit. Okay, number six. Kylie is generally considered to be blank. She really makes waves. I'm, I'm enabled. I'm Man, able. Amenable. 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 Part two. Hey, you know, now that we mentioned amenable, I recommend you to watch. Do you watch The Simpsons? Yes. Yeah. Um, this is like to understand slang in English. Try to uh, watch in YouTube and put Bart Simpson's crank calls. Crank calls. Let me write that for you. Right. Yeah. Crank calls. I crank. Crank calls. Remember uh, when Bart Simpson, he always calls yeah. Mo or the bartender? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, um, you should try and tell me if you understand it. I'll give you an example. He calls the bar and he says, hi, um, can I speak with Amanda Hug and Kiss? You know, he said, Amanda Hug and Kiss. And, and the bartender, Mo, okay, yeah, no problem. Hold on. Amanda Hug and Kiss. I need Amanda Hug and Kiss. And everybody starts laughing, right? Because yeah. if you analyze, it says a man to hug and kiss. A man to hug and kiss. <laughs> yeah, you know, everybody starts laughing. <laughs> because he starts saying, I need a man to, uh, uh, no, I need Amanda hug and kiss, Amanda hug and kiss. I want a man to hug and kiss. It's yeah. funny. And there's like a lot of crank calls that Bart Simpson does to, to the bar. So if you ever want to practice like slang English, listen to that. It's cool. It's funny. Okay, let's continue now with John. Oh, no, wait, number one, part two, it says, instruction, circle the word that best completes each sentence. I don't know why organic produce is so expensive. I am mystified. This one I didn't remember we did because it's not organic produce, it's products, remember? No products, yeah. Produce is a verb, so this is not correct. Number two, it says, John blank, when his shoes disappeared, no one else has size 14 feet. Baffled. Baffled. He was baffled. Baffled. Yeah, baffled. Can you give me an expression with baffled right now with your face? <laughs> yeah. It's like, I am. <laughs> That's baffled. I'm baffled. All right, um, number three, it says, my grandmother became blank with her cat when her cat died. Depressed. 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 Yeah. Joe, I'm um, Joy, I'm sorry. Joy knew sorry. she wouldn't get a job because she was blank anyway. Discouraged. She was discouraged <laughs> anyway. All right. Number five, it says, Marcos, Marcos was blank by the people talking loudly in the movie theater. Irritated. Irritated. He was irritated. Like the people. I get irritated when people smoke near, near me. You too. I get irritated when I hit my car again. Again. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. You hit the garage. I, I, I think I remember you hit the garage, right? Yes. 
How is that possible? Yes, it's for me, it's possible. <laughs> <laughs> Did I tell you that my brother, he got hit by a parked car? Sometimes <laughs> I, I said that. But when what? I am alone, I don't have any help. Help me. Oh. You know, my brother, he, he got hit by a parked car. How is that? Because we were playing, well, I wasn't there that day, but my friends told me that they were playing soccer. No, that we were playing actually Frisbee football. Do you know football? Yeah. That was the, that was the Frisbee. Yeah. Yeah. And um, so my brother was running, you know, like, hey, hey, I'm open, I'm open, I'm open. And he didn't see in front of him, so he hit the parked car. Wow. Wow. So everybody started laughing and like, wow, the first time I see get the chocon caro parqueado, you know. <laughs> so, that happened many years ago, but I mean, my brother will always be remembered for that. <laughs> okay, number six, it says, Lauren felt totally blank when her cake, oh, I'm sorry, when her car broke down again. <laughs> Irritated. 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 You know, although I wouldn't feel irritated when my car breaks down, I'll, I'll just feel discouraged. Because irritated is like, oh, like, oh, but this, I mean, it's just a matter of opinion. But like when my car, if my car continues breaking down, I just get discouraged. Like, ah, oh, yes, do. Uh, this has no cure. Forget it. This is the last one. I can not that. All right, number seven, it says, every time I hear news about homeless in our city, I am saddened. La doble D se pronuncia como R, saddened. What happened to June? I am blank as why he never showed up. Mystified. Unmystified. Mystified. Do you like in excess? Yes. They have a very cool song. Uh, only, not, only number one okay. was wrong. Yeah. Yes. Conform. Yes, conform. Then I used to conform. Oh, yeah, conform. Who, who <laughs> told us confront? I mean, I listen to you. <laughs> <laughs> Mystified, mystified. Hey, I see, I see Joanna is, in, is online now. Jordana. Yeah. I thought I saw her. Hi. Yeah. Oh, there she is. Yes. Hi, right, Jordana. How was your, how was your vacation? Did you go to a taco? Uh, yes, <laughs> I went to, I went to Cajutla. But unfortunately, I was sick the whole week. You sound a little sick right now. I'm still a bit sick, yeah. yes. Uh, excuse me for the question, but do you have COVID? No. No. Oh, well, I guess it was no. not COVID. Did you no, have no. the exam? No, maybe? Is, a, 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 is another COVID? It's another kind of COVID, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Um, I did not lose my smell or my taste, so I guess it wasn't. Oh, okay. It was just the did, flu. Did you, but... did you get examined? Did I get what? Did you get tested? Oh, no. Listen to that expression. Did you get tested? I didn't. Tested. Oh, okay. No, I didn't. All right. If you could, you should, because um, right now, really, I mean, I think, can you also Guillermo Guillermo Gallegos? Yeah, you know, sometimes dijo una cosa muy cierta. He dijo, el COVID empieza a ser serio hasta cuando ya le pasa a alguien o a algún ser querido. Yeah, you know, probably. and it's true. It's, it's true. For example, me after I got COVID, I I I, I am I am crazy now. Like, like. Uh, the only and... que, el único acuerdo que el único acuerdo que el único acuerdo que he hecho en su vida, ¿no? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> sí. <laughs> Oh, lo único um, cierto que ha dicho. No, there has not 
uh, how can I say? There have not been any uh, test made to anyone here. So yeah. you got to go to oh, okay. uh, Japan in order, in order oh, to get tested whenever possible, right? And, yeah. and we don't even know when they will have tests. Okay. So, and you know, you know why I'm telling you this? Be careful because you have two children, right? Yes. You know that children are getting infected now. Yeah, uh, my two boy, well, my two kids are like that. They we got COVID. Went to, no. Oh. No, we but got the no. Flu. Oh, okay. No, but you know, kids, are, kids are actually getting, um, they're getting contagious too now. And. Uh, and I, I had a bad experience today because my son was very sick, and then the hospital, the doctor told me, "Look, I need to have a, I need him, I need to see a COVID exam." And I said, "What? COVID? He's only yeah. four and a half. Yes, children are getting it now." And then you know, my my wife, she is in mamitas a domicilio thing on on WhatsApp. Okay. Y sale, you know, like uh, yeah, you know, en tal colegio se infectaron todos, and this and that. The only good thing is that children don't really get it like adults do. Mm -hmm. But still, it's not a risk you can afford to take. So, right, definitely. You know, everyone should be like careful for everything. I really got scared when 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 the doctor told me what children can get that. Yeah, and I said, "Oh my god!" But then when he told me, the only thing is up to now. Up to now, there's no like big cases on children dying. And hopefully it stays like that. Right. But if the COVID starts developing even more and when the children start dying, that's going to be a total chaos. Yeah. Yes, really hard. Mm -hmm. All right, next it says, uh, part D, write these, I'm sorry, write the words. Write the words, instructions. Write keep or stay to complete each sentence. Just type the word. No capital letter, period, is needed. All right, so let's start with you, Jordana. Can you do number one, please? Yes, if you want to keep your grades up, you have to study hard. All right, cool. If you want to keep your grades up, yes. All right, number two, Ricardo. It's hard to stay awake when you're studying late, late at night. All right, cool, next. Uh, Gio, num next, please. Number three, right? Yes. Okay. In order, in order to keep up with your assignments, it's best to write them, up, write, write them down, write them down, 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 down. All right, number five, Jaime. Well, number four, I'm sorry. Number four, yeah. Even, even during a crisis, is is important to to keep no no to to keep things in perspective. In perspective, yes. Keep things okay. in perspective. So then, the phrase over there is keep in. Keep in. Like keep in touch. Keep in, touch, yeah. Keep in perspective. All right, let me see next. Cari. Hi. Hi, Cari. It's hasta hoy veo su apellido Monches. I never heard that name before, Monches. Really? No. It's the first yeah, time. it's not so common. Yeah. Yes, es, es Monches. Monches is, but then. No, Monches. Monches. Mm -hmm. All right, cool. All right, Miss Monches, can you do number um, set five? Five. Number, number five. five. Okay, working full time makes it make it makes it difficult to keep up with schoolwork. All right, cool. Rosalena, number six. Many students drink coffee in order to keep awake during the early classes. Okay, good. In this case, it's actually stay awake. Stay away. Stay away. Stay away. Okay. Sorry, sorry. Stay awake. You say that expression like, you know, hey, 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 stay awake. 
You know, sometimes when you're in those boring meetings. Yeah. Okay, guys, stay awake. Or, you know, sometimes somebody's driving and they're sleeping. Hey, please stay awake. No, he didn't say this. He just hit them. Hey. <laughs> yeah. The hell, man. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. So, uh, Rosalina, it's, it's actually stay awake. Okay. Stay with me. Let's just breathe. Okay. Um, instructions. Nice. It says, write the correct form of drive, get, or make to complete each sentence. Sometimes more than one answer is possible. Do not use capital letters or period. So let's start with Michelle, number one. People who interrupt me when taking, oh, I'm sorry, can you do number one? Please? A teacher. Yes. Well, I, I can see the, well, the thing that you are presenting. It's black. Can you read it please? Okay, great. Uh, does anybody see my, my screen? Yes. I think it's, yes, it's, it's on, it. yes. it's on my phone. Okay. I think okay. when I put it, it gets black. Oh, okay, no problem. No problem. Thank you. Hold on. Let me put, let me put mine right now. People who, it says people who interrupt me when I'm, when I'm talking really blank me up the wall. Drive me. What are the options? A drive, get, or make? Drive. So the expression here is, um, Listen, the instruction it says, use the correct form of drive, get, drive. or make. So people who interrupt me when I'm talking really, mm, right? Me Amy. up the wall. Uh -huh. Get. Oh, okay. Uh, no, in this case, drive. it would be drive. Drive. And you know what? Don't worry about not knowing this because these are these are only um, English expressions. You know, talking about um, driving up the wall. Did you see that car in 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 El Redondel Paso del Jaguar? The the car that uh, went up. Yeah, it was, it was a pickup. <laughs> yeah, I live like two blocks from there. And every time I pass by there, I still don't understand how that was possible. Really, I promise you, I don't understand because, okay, the story is that the car behind hit the pickup, right? Um, there was a car in, because it was all a downhill. Little car, a little car. Yeah, a little car hit the pickup. Okay, and so the, okay, good. I understand that part. I pass by that almost every day and, and I always look and said, how is this possible? Because that wall is almost vertical. Yeah. Almost. So that pickup had to go the sidewalk, La Cera, and still go up that. I don't understand how that happened. Really, I really wish there were some cameras because I really want to see how that happened. Because that wall really is like, it's like this. It's not vertical, vertical, but it's very close to being vertical. I don't <laughs> know how a car can go up. Or how, be, a very good jump. Yeah, but you know, still, still, the car had to go the sidewalk, La Cera. Just by hitting the sidewalk, that could reduce a little the speed. But it still went up. It, and it was all, almost in the middle. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Someday, I, I really want to know how that happened. <laughs> Eso es literalmente drive up the wall. <laughs> <laughs> literal. Yeah, literally, it's drive up the wall. But you know, that's an expression that really doesn't make sense. But when you say, man, you drive me up the wall, it's like, you drive me crazy. Okay, number two, let me see who's next. Um, 
Yeah, okay, Yanira, can you do the last one, please? Number two. Yes. It it makes me sick when sick when a stores and restaurants to away good food. I'm sorry, can you repeat that? It makes me sick when a stores and restaurants throw away good food. Throw away good food, good. You know, I was speaking with a, with a manager from Pizza Hut and he explained to me why they can't give that food away. Do you know because why? They can be sued. They can be yeah. sued. Yes, unfortunately. Yes, and he told me because, you know, he says, because that food is actually going to the garbage. And he tells me there's a lot of food that they throw away. But if somebody... Do you know how to say indigente in English? Homeless? Homeless. homeless. If a homeless person homeless. eats the food that we gave to them and they get sick, they can sue us. Yeah. And I said, but I don't think a homeless, yeah, maybe one, I mean, maybe a million homeless, they wouldn't say anything, but one will just to try to get money. So then they say, yeah. more, you know, they have to. They have to throw away all that food. Okay. Um, number three. Yes, number three. Let's start again. Jordana. Can you do number three, please? Yes. Yeah, so my brother is always teasing me. He really makes me my he really makes my blood boil. Yes. That expression also exists in Spanish, right? <laughs> oh, my blood boils. Like, oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. You make my blood boil. Mm. All right, and let's finish this real quick. No, no, no. Number five, people who throw trash on the ground Make, make, me, make, make, me, make me mad. Make me mad. Make me mad. Make no makes. Because, because it's, it's not people. People is a plural. So, uh, yeah. Uh, they... Plural word. Yeah. yeah. Good. People is plural, right? Yeah. Yes. yes. If it were singular, it would have as she makes me. Yeah. Yes. She drives me. She drives me crazy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Remember that song? Yeah. Like no one else. Okay. And last one, my sister always gossips. She really, and this is true. This I think this is yeah. example is <laughs> really on my sister. My sister always gossips. <laughs> she really blank yeah, under get, my skin. Get get get, get, under, get my, under my skin. Get get, get, get. get. Yeah. yeah. You know, I yeah. love I love that expression because get under your skin. I don't think that exists in Spanish, but oh, Get under your skin is like when somebody has a limit that like really, uh, I think maybe that's the Spanish word will be te tengo entre ceja y ceja, man. But when people say get under the skin, it's like playing a psychological game. For example, <laughs> uh, I, I don't know if I told you last time, do you watch MMA fighting? What? The MMA, you know, Ma McGregor, he... No. Nope. Okay, but the fighters, before they fight, they say, yeah, you little punk, you know, <laughs> you little girl, I'm going to... Oh, you, when I kill you, your wife is going to love me. What, whatever, you know, you're trying to get under my skin so I can not concentrate. Psychologic. Yeah. Yes. Hay uno que se llama McGregor, que es como representante yeah. de la MMA. Conor y, McGregor. Yeah, Conor McGregor. And it's funny because he, yeah, yeah, you know, he, he's like a show off. Y peleó con Khabib. Did you see that? Peleó con un ruso que era muy mm -hmm. disciplinado. Yeah. Y sabía que, oh, you little boy, you, you know, you, you know. Y le dio una taleguiada al ruso que lo dejó mudo. <laughs> <laughs> You know, and that's why he didn't get under my skin. It was funny. I love watching that match porque 
no lo cachimbió, se le hizo una llave que lo hizo que él se venciera, like, que es más penoso, pues. Es sumisión. Ajá, like a submission, hey, hey, hey. y me doy. Y después ahí se soltó, ok, now talk, now talk, le dijo. That was a good fight. It was a very good fight. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, watch it in YouTube if you can. Okay, class. Thank you very much. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, have a happy Thank Monday. You. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Good night. Have a good night. Bye. Bye.